I'm waiting, Cloud. I'm here on the Midgar Expressway. The scene is indescribable. Countless buildings have been leveled, and part of the road has collapsed. The smoke rising from the rubble is reminiscent of a funeral pyre. Of course, this is only the most recent in a series of crises. Multiple reactor bombings, followed by the fall of the... It the fall of the Sector 7 plate, culminating in this unprecedented destruction caused by a massive tornado which swept through Sectors 0, 1, and 2. After a briefing with Shinra investigators, Mayor Domino released a statement declaring the tornado to be, quote, weather warfare perpetrated by the infamous insurgent group known as Avalanche. The administration also suspects the involvement of Wutai, and has begun investigations into the matter. This is only the most recent in a series of crises. Multiple reactor bombings, followed by the fall of the... It, the fall of the Sector 7 plate. Boy, that tornado really did a number on the city. I thought another reactor blew up. Which must have been caused zero, by the tornado. Man, when it rains, it pours. As you can see. Ah, over there. Amidst the wreckage of the expressway, search and rescue operations are already in progress. So you're right. That soldier, armed with a buster sword, highly dangerous. I repeat, the fugitive is an ex-soldier, armed with a buster sword. Huh? Back over here. Get him on board. Prep for takeoff. The rescue team has pulled people from the rubble. Quick, get the camera off him. Come on, this way. Contact the SAR team. Targets have been secured. We are exfilling via helo now. Move it. We're taking off. What? Hey, turn that off. The, the survivors are being taken away. I got it. I'm all ready. Right. You don't know when that way to you. Excuse me. Could you look after my friend? Just for a bit. Too much Mako. But he'll be fine. <laughs> hey!
where that's going to be. Tell the rest of us about you and your buddy Sephiroth? Sure. If Tifa doesn't mind. Me? Yeah, no problem. It's cool. It all started five years ago. I was 16 at the time. There was hardly any work for soldiers back then. The little there was, it was boring as hell. My heart wasn't in it. Then, out of nowhere, the job of a lifetime came. A mission with Sephiroth. I couldn't believe my luck. It's really coming down, huh? Hey man, feeling any better? I'm good. Sure don't look it. I wish I could help, but never been motion sick. Sorry, man. Ready to do this? Yeah, you bet.
Say, I'd like to be briefed on a mission at some point. Because if it's another one of those Turks gigs, you can let me off right here. Really? Finally make first, what do they do? Call a ceasefire with Utah, stealing my shot at glory. I didn't join Soldier to be an errand boy. I joined up so I could be a hero, like you. <laughs> well, our mission is to survey a rundown reactor. Another one of those Turks gigs. Job's a job, I guess. Where is it? Nibelheim. Nibelheim? That's where I grew up. Got some fiends in our 12! Let's go. in a different league from the rest of us. Nibelheim. That's where they built the first reactor. Right? Yeah. It all started in the fall. Something was wrong with the reactor, and the whole village was up in arms. Talk of strange new monsters on the mountain only made things worse. People were scared, desperate. The villagers tried to take care of the monsters themselves, but it was no good. Ended up calling Shinra. So the company sent help. Best they had. feel. I have no home, so I wouldn't know. Uh, you still got parents though, right? A mother named Genova. She died shortly after I was born. My father. Whoa there! Genova? Like from the Shinra building? Yeah. Don't worry, I'm getting to that. <laughs> Why am I talking about this? Come on, let's go. Hope I didn't keep you waiting. I'm Xander, the mayor here. I wanted to greet you myself, to uh, welcome you to our humble little town. Please, if you'll follow me. Consider yourself off duty till sundown.
Going Whoa! With real soldiers! Just a bit. Keep your wits about you, people. Beware of me. The Nibelheim Watch is standing guard, sir. If anyone on the survey team is feeling hungry, be sure to stop by. Don't make any trouble for Sephiroth. That sword's huge! Can I touch it? Oh, you're off duty. Isn't that nice? I'd like to see how so well, as I live and breathe. Wow. Uh, the survey team is the coolest. Man, why didn't I enlist like everyone else when I got the chance? City folk are so sophisticated. Mm -hmm. Hmm. A soldier. And you are? Richard Sangan. A humble traveler of the world. And teacher of martial arts to the youth. Hmm. but lacking mass. You need to bulk up. Who asked you? You could learn a lot from me. Pass. Don't be shy. I have many pupils your age. At last count, 128! In fact, one of them's from this very village. Perhaps you know her. Tifa. Sure. A real talent, that one. She'll go far. <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah, right? Got anything to say for yourself? I didn't know. I'd be interested to see how one of Shinra's finest fights. <laughs> We're all thrilled to have you. Folk are so sophisticated. Can only imagine what they're. Goodness! Is that you, Cloud? We got to talk to him too. But now is not the time. Then I stop by my mom's. Not that it matters. Sure it does. I know I want to hear what happened. Me too. Yeah. Go on. My dad died when I was a kid, so after I left for Midgar, she was on her own. It was the first time we'd seen each other in two years. First time, and last. Hmm? I'll be right there! <gasps> Cloud, is that you? Hey. Welcome home. Come in. Let me get a good look at you. My, my. So that's what they've got you wearing, huh? You soldiers sure do clean up nice. 
I've never been so proud. The man you've become? Women must be hounding you day and night. Not really. You know, there's all kinds of temptations in the big city. I'd feel a lot better if I knew you'd found a good girl. One who'd make sure you didn't get into trouble. I can take care of myself. An older, more mature girl that could keep you on the straight and narrow and tell you when you're being a silly goose. That's the perfect type for you, I'd say. They are feeding you properly, aren't they? Oh, Cloud! But you know, Cloud. Wouldn't you agree, Cloud? You're my son. Of course, I'll always be here. Okay, that's enough. Everyone? Just for a bit. Could you keep up? Weak legs betray a weak mind. Ever since we heard a survey takes me coming, back, we've been working our fingers to the bone. I'd like to see how soldiers keep it. Finally. Soon these troubles will be a thing of the past. Ah, Shinra's here, I see. Thank you for coming. You're Shinra? Shinra? Oh, whoops! I didn't recognize you, Cloud. How you've grown. I must say, you look dashing in that uniform. You're so cool! You're so cool! You a soldier? You a shoulder? You just... you look so different. <laughs> you wouldn't have lasted a day. Who was it that used to say how scary the military was? How did it feel being back up there? I don't know. Nostalgic, I guess? After two years away, and all that. Uh-huh.
long time since we had this much excitement. Huh? You went to my place? I figured you might be there. Wait a second. You two were neighbors? We were, but... It's not like we hung out that much. We had our reasons. <laughs> our reasons, huh? <laughs> Bet most of them had to do with you. Remember my cat? Her name was... Fluffy, I think? Yeah. She was always disappearing. And that day was no different. my room? I did. You went through my stuff? I know I shouldn't have. Cloud! You, you asshole! asshole. Did you actually play it? Landscape. Huh? I could swear I've seen it before. You okay? Big day tomorrow. We'll be leaving bright and early. You should get some rest. All right. We'll do.
tried, but I couldn't get to sleep that night. I was too excited, too nervous. It was pretty much the same for me. Why? <laughs> yeah, I was surprised too. What happened the last time she went up there? That was years ago, Brian. She's old enough to make her own decisions now. <laughs> we leave once our guide arrives. Yes, sir. Uh, Brian! Sephiroth, sir, <sighs> I must insist that I take you up the mountain. My daughter isn't- Dad! Tifa, you can still back out. You don't have to do this. I'm going, and that's that. There'll be two soldiers with me. I'll be fine. Pumpkin. Good morning, sir. I'll be your guide for the day. Tifa? You're our guide? I sure am. You can ask anyone around here. I'm the best there is. You could get hurt. Not if you remember to do your job, she won't. Come on. For a posterity, sir? Not today. Can you talk to him? Please, Sephiroth. It mean a lot to us. It's just one photo. Come on. Where's the harm in that? Thanks. Say cheese! Sounds like you were having a good time. One more! Yeah, I guess we were. Later. For a while. The reactor was halfway up Mount Nebel. I was looking forward to breathing that crisp, clean mountain air again. already know this, but our reactor's the first of its kind. It really put Mount Nebel on the map. I've seen two reactors in my time, but none with such a breathtaking view. Who could tire of it? Everyone, eventually. Man, I wish I could go on trips all over the world like you guys. <laughs> trips? I think you mean business trips, which are no fun at all. Though you do learn stuff on them. That's so cool. Even so, you'll burn yourself out running like that. I'm not even close to burned out. Not with all the training I've had. <laughs> Guess you really are the best there is.
seen those near the village, and they're not nice. What do you think? I think I got this. Then they're all yours. Copy that. Let's finish. See ya. Now. You're done. That was awesome. You think? If this is how it's going to be, there doesn't seem much point in me fighting. I guess not. You leave it all to me, huh? Don't mind if I do. You're done. Piece of cake. Is that Mako? Whoa. Soldier, you can do better than that, can't you? Just you watch. Let's finish this. Bye. I gotta say, that one felt pretty good. Take it away! <laughs> You're 
Shall we pick up the pace? Not unless we absolutely have to. Our guide might not be so lucky next time. Then, how about I go on ahead and clear the way for you guys? I'll be careful. <laughs> You'd better. Cool. See you at the reactor. a while ago. Come on back, okay? Okay. through a Shinra facility. To think I almost made you our guide. Good thing I reconsidered. Otherwise, you'd have led us straight off a cliff. 
lead on. Yes. Pretty good. The reactor may have been around for a while, but there are still pockets of Mako gas all over the mountain. Try not to breathe it in if you can. You don't want to get Mako poisoning. Elevator access restricted due to Mako gas concentrations. Air purification unit must be employed to clear excess Mako gas.
Come on. about crossing that thing then let me go first hey I'm the guide here Fate's hands now. Do you know the way? Yeah. Following the river should get us back to the village. We're not going to the village. Can you get us to the reactor? Sorry, I... I don't think I can. I see. Well... We certainly can't send you back alone. You'll be safer with us. Okay. I'll be joining you up front this time. What? For your performance review. You kidding me? Good luck. Stand back, Sephiroth! Take the lead! Who are you? Hold still!
lethal gas ahead. There's no way around it either. Just have to go through it. Let's not waste any time. Mako, this thick is dangerous. Mako Spring. It's beautiful. <sighs> yeah, but if we keep using Mako to power our homes, springs like this will disappear, right? What are you talking about? Who told you that? My dad. And the mayor, if you must know. Except the planet's huge. Mako will never run out, right? Naturally formed materia. And look at the size of it. Astounding. For the Mako energy to condense into something like this, it must have taken an eternity. I've always wondered, how does Materia let you cast spells exactly? <laughs> how did you ever get to be a soldier? Hmm? To put it simply, the knowledge of the ancients is sealed within each orb. That knowledge not only connects us to the planet, it allows us to tap into her power. That's how we can use magic. Or so they say. Really? Magic sure is weird. <laughs> <laughs> I know someone who'd be livid to hear you call it weird. Or magic for that matter. I can just imagine what he'd say. It's an affront to science. Who? Hojo from research and development. His predecessor was a great man, but him, he is anything but. <laughs> we should press on.
Gaza. Let's hurry.
way out. Wait. something here but everything you've said makes Sephiroth sound like a stand-up guy well he was and now he's pure evil trying to kill everyone on the planet help me to understand this shit tell me something that'll really make my blood boil oh I will I will Wait out 
here, Tifa. No way! I want to go too! Please? Sorry, no civilians. Even if we weren't on a mission. Come on! Keep the young lady safe. Carry on. You better keep me safe. Didn't expect it to be all systems go. You'd think it'd be running at reduced output. Let me guess. The pillagers don't have a clue about this. No one should know? Of course not. The company really needs to be more transparent. Tell that to the president. What exactly is the problem with this place? The people in charge. While most reactors are under the jurisdiction of urban planning, this one is overseen by R&D. Huh. Why do I suddenly have a bad feeling about this? Whatever you see here, you are not to speak of it. Oh, I won't. Say a few words to your sword first. something. What are those things? Genova? Wasn't that...
doing? These pods were built for the production of artificial materia. But Hojo repurposed them as incubators. Cages for animals. And shields with Mako. All to birth a new breed of monster. But he didn't stop at animals. Oh no. There were other subjects. Look. Eventually, we went back to the inn. But when we got there, Sephiroth locked himself in his room. The mayor had been looking forward to having dinner with bona fide soldiers, so he didn't take the news too well. Dad had to put up with his belly aching for hours afterward. Huh? Hmm? Must have sucked. But what about Sephiroth? What happened to him? He left. Didn't tell a soul where he was going. Sephiroth as he was heading for Shinra Manor, and he acted like I wasn't even there. Busy, I suppose. He's holed up inside the mansion. Something's been off ever since he came back from the reactor. Too much exposure to Mako? Then we ought to bring him some medicine. biggest building in town, and older than the reactor. The company used to conduct research there, back when they were still a small manufacturer. Even so, the rent on that plot was basically what kept the village of home. Well, here we are. What now? I mean, the whole place is pitch black. You think he's sleeping or something? What if he's sick and needs our help? Him? A little Mako poisoning isn't gonna hurt a living legend. Took a look around the place, but Sephiroth was nowhere to be seen. Never knew it had a basement. It was news to me too. 
not anyone in the village had a clue. Excavated from a 2,000 year old rock layer, a life form in stasis. Professor Gast named this life form Genova. MEGL 77 1977. Genova. Verified as an ancient. MEGL 913 1977. Genova Project approved. So, they named the life form Genova. And once they understood what she was, they grew ambitious. Hey, Sephiroth. What you got there? Leave me be. And that was it. He stayed holed up in the basement. Reading. Reading, like a man possessed. Hmm. We got Genova. A locked reactor door, the name of Sephiroth's mother, and ancients. Ah, screw it. Racking my brain's not gonna get me anywhere. May as well just ask the guy. the most fascinating passage. The specimen found in strata dating back 2,000 years smiled with what could only be described as ethereal grace. Though the truth eluded me at first, I later determined that she was an ancient, or a steward of the planet, as they are referred to in legend. She needed a name. And so I dubbed her Genova. The Genova project was approved soon after. A bold initiative to resurrect the long dead ancients. An initiative that resulted in my conception. Or rather, my creation. The crowning glory of Professor Gast Wondrous experiment! He created you? asking myself, 
Why couldn't I have come too sooner? If I had, maybe I could have saved the village. Or tried, at least. What? 